Rail Authority is responding to complaints from Kalihi business owners who've been putting up with the utility relocation project for nearly a year. Officials tell our Eddie Dowd it'll be at least another six years before the traffic cones go away. Well, that's right. Many businesses we've talked to along Dillingham Boulevard tell us they are feeling the hurt because they've seen a drop in business due to construction in the area. Some even saying they might have to close their doors for good. Now, Hart says it's working to increase accessibility for businesses in this area, but there's only so much they can do. We're out here every day. Joey Manahan is no stranger to Kalihi, having represented the area for 16 years in both the state legislature and Honolulu City Council. He now works for Hart to engage with the community as construction for Skyline creeps further into his former district. Kalihi is open for business. One of the biggest concerns has been access as these cones stretched a road for more than a mile, blocking cars from making left turns. Dillingham is really a traffic and I'm trying to avoid here. Manahan showed us some of the most recent changes Hart has made in response to complaints. In just the last month, it's widened entrances to businesses on the side they are on and adding these blue signs directly on the road that let drivers know when they can turn right into the business. We do everything from coordinate deliveries. Uh, we work around business hours if the work's going to be truly disruptive. Google and Apple Maps are updated. But some believe the only thing that will bring back lost customers is if access to their business is available from both lanes. They say that they avoid this area. This brand new Asian grocery store on Dillingham Boulevard opened earlier this year. Our cameras saw mostly empty aisles. Staff say if things don't change, they may have to close down. If it still continue like this, I think we, our business will go down and go come like back. And then maybe we will go to close, make the road more bigger or more way to come here. We asked Manahan about the request, who told us allowing left turns on both lanes is one thing they cannot change. You know, there is a bigger picture here, uh, and that's rail, right? And rail is a catalyst uh, for the revitalization of Kalihi. So you're saying there might be some hurt during this period, but once rail is completed, the benefits will outweigh all of that? Absolutely. I, I think the area residents need it, and at the end of the day, it's going to be a boon for businesses. Eddie Dowd, Hawaii News Now.